hey guys welcome back on my youtube channel and today i'm gonna show you how you can use custom font in your ios application so guys sometimes uh, our requirement is what uh, whenever we are going to develop a new application so our application required a unique font or a different font that is provided by uh, our you know what xcode right so we need a different font okay we can say we want to use a custom font so how we can use within our application okay so for that uh, let's get start so first of all you will go on your browser that may be chrome or you can use safari whatever uh, you like okay guys so for that what you will do first of all you will download your font okay so let's say i want to use a new new nitro font okay so uh, you can download your new nitro font from here or somewhere else okay so after downloading uh, i have already downloaded so let me show you so this is the font directory which i have downloaded and i have renamed as fonts okay so as you can see we have new new nitro black and extra bold bold semi bold okay so all the variant of this font is here okay so now what i want to use what i want to do i want to use this font in our application okay so for that let me go in our application so guys this is a very basic application setup which i have done okay so now uh, let me show you how you can apply that font so for that all you need to do what just drag and drop a label here where you want to place your uh, you know what text with a custom font so let's say this is our label and now let me set some uh, auto layout constraints so our label is going to be in the center of our screen and now let me change the text here like uh, this is label with custom font are you getting my point so this is our you know what label now let me show you uh, is there any font of named uh, nunito here or not so first of all let me choose the font as the custom here and as you can see there are some font families so let me search for the nunito font so as you can see guys we don't have any uh, any font related to nunito okay guys so now what i need to do here i need to import our fonts directory within our application so that we can use these fonts in our application okay so for that what you will do first of all i am going in my uh, you know what project directory and now i am going to create a new group sorry and let me create a new group and the group name i want to give as you know what like resources okay so you can give any name of this folder and basically this folder we use to uh, use the external resources in our application okay so what i'm going to do here guys i am just going to drag and drop my this fonts directory in this resources folder okay so let me copy it okay so i have successfully copied here and uh, okay fine so after copying here what you will do you will just go in the uh, you know what project uh, you know what project information here and uh, okay so here you can find out your info.plist file and you will do what you will add here a row right and you will uh, you know what uh, you will um, you can say you will search for the application fonts is it Mm, fonts provided by the application okay so you will search fonts provided by the application just hit the enter and after that it will provide an array okay so within this array you can see there is a item zero so here you will write your font name whatever the file you have imported so make sure the file name and the font name should be same for example i want to use uh, nunito regular okay so for that let me copy the name okay and uh, let me go here once again and let me paste it here so guys as you can see i have added one font now you want to add another font then in the same way you can uh, just copy sorry just copy the name 
and uh, let's paste it here and let me add one more that is again um, it will be you know what um, I'm gonna use it is as light okay so guys as you can see we have uh, three fonts we have imported now we can use these three fonts in our application okay so what you will do guys uh, you can do one more thing here you can define a constant file where you can define your fonts and you can use in your application by the way um, leave it just let me show you one thing that is what so this is our uh, storyboard and this is our label now let me go in the this fonts and let me click on this family and uh, as you can see guys um, is there no need to why it is not getting here okay let me build the application okay now let me search once again okay yeah as you can see guys there is no need to okay and this of this font I want to use the regular style okay so I have given the regular style and now let me increase the size right so this is 22 font and uh, let me create the outlet of this uh, label so that at the runtime I will be able to show you what is the actual font we are using with this label okay so I can give the name as label test okay you can give any name whatever you like now here as you can see within this view did load uh, what I am going to do here I am um, okay so bef after loading uh, I'm going to call a lifecycle method that is view did appear and within this view did appear method I'm going to print out I'm just going to print out my label font okay which font have been assigned to this label I want to know so I am going to print the font of this label so let me run it and let me show you okay okay guys so this is our uh, label uh, with a you know a custom font and let me show you the font name okay so guys as you can find out uh, the font family is uh, to regular and the font weight is normal okay now let me show you uh, with the bold okay so for that uh, let me go in this font and uh, let me choose the stylus bold okay so I want to make it as bold so let me run it and let me show you which font is going to use so as you can see guys it is uh, going to use the Nunito font as the font with bold okay and the font style is again normal and so this is all about our custom font how you can use and this font is applicable on your all the views like buttons or the labels or the text field you can use this font anywhere in your application after importing only a single time okay so guys i hope you like this video and if you are having any question related to custom fonts then you can comment in the comment section uh, i will try to resolve and i will try to reply you okay guys so if you like the video then hit the like button and comment in the comments box share with your friends and if you are not subscribed my channel yet then kindly subscribe my channel thank you have a nice day